growing up, I remember kids wanted to be ballerinas, astronauts, firefighters. I wanted to be better than everyone. And my mom was right there with me. She was like, you're better than everyone at everything. And I was like, I can't even lie. When you're right, you're right. And then I found out that she was just lying to make me feel good. So I did a little experiment with her. Our art teacher in the third grade gave us a project where we had to draw flowers in a vase with a background in pastel. Those were the only requirements. We were eight years old. Most kids were doing like daisies, daffodils, blue backgrounds, red backgrounds. I did this. My teacher must have thought I was sucking on LSD tabs like lollipops. The teacher puts all the art up on the wall. I bring my mom into class one day and I said, mom, 30 different art drawings. Which one's the prettiest? And she's like, well, which one's yours, sweetie? I'm like, you don't get to know. You just have to pick the prettiest. Now her soul is falling out of her ass because she has to pick the prettiest. It has to be mine or I am disowning her and she knows it. So my mom looks at all the drawings, not knowing which one's mine. Knowing she's on the clock, she takes a shot. She points at the one that looks like Andy Warhol and Rainbow Dash had a torrid love affair and says that one. That one's the prettiest. And I said, oh, that's mine. She almost fell to her knees in relief. And to this day, I think those flowers are only up on our wall today because it commemorates my mom's success as a mother.